All right, so on the back of, I just did this on the back of my first one, the one that had my building on it. You're gonna do a value scale. So you're gonna basically just take a ruler and don't outline this in a marker, otherwise it'll show through. But you're pretty much just going to go around the thickness of the ruler, draw a line down, and then divide that as evenly as you can into five different sections. One, two, three, four, five. You're gonna do what's called a value scale. So that means five is gonna be the darkest you can go, by pressing as hard as you can, one is going to be as light, you're barely tickling it. And then three is about the normal um, amount that you write with, normal pressure. So I always start with the darkest one and then go um, a little bit lighter, a little bit lighter, so I can adjust. So like these two, I think this one has to get a little bit darker. And so the pencil that I'm using is what's called an ebony pencil. Some of you may have used it before. Um, it allows you to get almost to a black, uh, which a normal pencil does not allow you to get to. Make this one a little bit darker. All right, so I did this to figure out how dark my pencil can go and how light it can go because I'm going to need to incorporate that later on when I use value in my picture. So you can see right here, I have the darkest one, I have the middle, the medium, the lightest, and then the absolute, or the second lightest, and then the lightest. So that needs to be in your picture. So this is just on the back of that. It has to be in a pencil. You can actually just go around it with the ebony pencil, and that's fine. But this part is graded. You have to do this. You have to show me this. Uh, but yeah. Um, when you're done with that, outline this in Sharpie. Um, you just take your Sharpie, literally outline it. Um, and then if you look at this one, I did not erase my pencil lines yet. You can still see it in the back. All you have to do is take an eraser and just hold it from the corner and go and erase your pencil lines before you begin adding value. You need to think also about light source. Um, light source. So if I look at this picture, my light source is this flame that's roasting the marshmallows in the middle. So it's gonna be lighter in all of these areas because of the flame and darker on the outside edges where there isn't any flame. Also up here it's going to be darker because none of the light can get to it but the edge is going to be lighter because it's close to that flame. Um, you have to have one light source in your pictures. Questions? Let me know.